one thing I do want to do is um, do another dino wipe. Remember the S this time. I think I did right. I don't know. I'll see in the morning. Maybe. I don't know. And also, when I said I did a few metal runs, it might have been a bit more than a few. It's at 350, 450 ammo. Or metal. Then I've got a bit of metal in here. Honestly, not that much. I guess the other bit of my metal went here. Plus, I got a few crystal obsidian somewhere. Yeah. Also, I made a lot of um, polymer just because I was going on an obsidian run. Crafted a few things like an industrial grill. Uh, a fridge with two couple metal arrows. And also I keep all my organic in here because if it stacks it... Well it's not all going to go at I've got the 22 minutes or something like that. Alright, so the reason why I've got like so much metal and all that is to just my arch and here. 364. With me holding the metal. Now if I was just to transfer it across... 290. So basically, all the metal that it carries uh, counts as half. And also, it's basically a um, smithy or something like that. It can craft all this stuff. Alright, so what I feel like I should do now is like name some of my uh, dinos. I won't name them all, I've just got names for free. I don't know, really. And also, I'm on the drops. Also got a pretty good saddle. It's not the best, but it is better than the, like the base one. All right, so Bob saw it's a frog that has like a flower on his back, and considering like this is a frog as well, but it's got no flower. What I'm just gonna call it is Frogosaur. Mm, probably not how it is actually spelled, but oh well. Alright, so the next dino I'm going to name is like my main Paradon. And, like really, Paradon may not be its actual name. But it is going to be this guy's name. Because I have no idea how to actually spell the name, but too bad. Paradon. And the last one, even though it is probably an eagle. Uh, just because I'm probably never going to tame one of these animals. Yeah, so the name I'm going to give to this is Quetzal. Just had to look it up to make sure I was getting the right spelling of it. Well, I mean, like, really. Closest thing to a Quetzal, really. It can hold, like, a fair bit of weight. Quetzal's probably about a thousand or something like that, but... Also, this is like a... I can portal smithy, so why not really? Now I'm actually going to take my RG Quetzal out uh, because I want to check out the volcano because it's actually something special there that I didn't quite see the first time, the first few times because I didn't want to fall in, but once I went down, yeah. And also with this thing you can't like change its movement speed, but the good thing is it's got a lot of stamina, so. Yeah, you can just like stamp the boost. Yeah, because I'm pretty sure I did Dino Wipe, I'm just gonna give it the check over to make sure there's no like spinos around. No, it doesn't look like it. It seems like I can't spell. I accidentally got the R and the O mixed up. Much better. Alright, so I've done like a few laps around. Doesn't look like any surprises. But I did see like a Sarko trying to take out my uh, beaver population, so I'm going to take like Frogosaur. So, a cool thing about my frog, I don't reckon it loses stamina in the water. 
And also, aren't the beavers took the saga out? I don't see it right. Okay, so it looks like with the beavers, I've got a level um, 30 something and a level 4. So, I might as well tell you how this frog works. So, basically, it's a torpor frog, and the most efficient way is to. Oh, don't spam. Like it's attack. Uh, just do one attack. Wait a bit. Now attack. The whole lick jump tactic does work with frogs. Well, most creatures. Okay, so I went to level 34. Um, I'll just let the floor around to do. I don't know, I'll just let, let it wake up. Oh, right. Yeah, it's tall paws going way down, so I'm taking Frogosaur back to. I'll get like some narcotics. I don't reckon it's going to be worth it, but. Sure, I'll just do it anyway. I'm gonna lose a lot of narcotics to this beaver. You know, when I saw this thing was level 34, I did not reckon it would have to take 34 narcotics plus go with berries to take. Even though it is female, I thought of a good name for it, I guess. Because they make the dams out of woods and the normally in lakes or something like that. Uh, yeah, this one's going to be called Timber Lake. Oh well. Alright, so the male beavers still like to swim around, so... Hopefully it should make some dams. I don't know, really. Or I might have to do, like, another dino wipe and... Oh well, I've got one beaver, it doesn't really matter. That's actually the reason the last time why they got killed. That and a psycho. Okay, now that I've finally got all the dino wipe stuff out the way, I should probably check on the volcano now. Oh yeah, something weird happens with the RGs. They get like this healing boost. I have no idea what that's about. But oh well. Run to over some. Diplo. I can't be bothered. I feel like the blue paradox sort of looks nice, but I feel like what I'm looking for. Alright, so this is the volcano. And also something I have realised is I've been walking around like Gamma 4. Like all this time, this game's still been dark. Uh, this is what it's actually meant to look like. Yeah, it is dark here. Alright, so for reasons it's a volcano, it's kind of hot down there. Anyway, you got your metal, uh, your crystal, your obsidian. But the thing I actually wanted to check out was that door thing over there. I don't know, but... Um, if it's some boss thing, probably not the best idea to bring my... RG into it, but we'll see. Okay. Um, yeah, what is this one? Okay, hadn't seen any of those things. I've seen a few of those, but. Yeah, I reckon this is endgame stuff, and. I don't reckon I'll get even close to these because apparently you've got to take down Alpha Broodmothers, Carnosauruses, Dragons. I don't know, just for like this place one. Megapificus. Yeah, 
I don't reckon I'll be doing this anytime soon. Or at all. I'll probably finish this series before I get to that. Anyway, I might as well take my RG go. Unless I'm on crystal. Obsidian. I might take a bit of obsidian. You know, considering I'm here and it's basically one of the only places you can get it. Oh, apparently this is a note. How exactly is it raining in Ampocano? Anyway, I'm full on water. Okay, now's a good time to check my map and see if I have to go this way. If you want to know, here's actually where I found my RG. Well, a bit down from the volcano, it's just around here somewhere. I don't know, really. It is still dark, and this is the highest setting you can have. Now that the rain's cleared up, and I can actually sort of see, uh, yeah, I reckon it was about here ish here on the map. I don't know, it was somewhere around the base of the volcano. Yeah, I was trying to get my spino up, but apparently spinos can't go up mountains. Thought it was an alpha, but it's just like a spino. Uh, try. I reckon there's any beavers close by, so yeah, I'll just take all this and yep, uh, time to go. 